What's going on, everyone? Chris from PickDogs.com here with your free pick, Indy LaSalle versus Dayton. College basketball matchup going down Tuesday, January 23rd, 2024. Just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, the games that I love the most, including my daily $19 best bet, make sure that you head on over to PickDogs.com and click the Premium Picks tab at the top of the page. But let's get to this one between LaSalle and Dayton. And LaSalle coming into this one with a record of 10-8 and eight on the year. Losers are three in a row, dropping a 1-4 and four in conference play after an 82-62 loss on the road at the hands of St. Joe's. Meanwhile, Dayton coming into this one at 15-2 and two on the year. Winners of 12 in a row, improving to 5-0 and oh in conference play after a 96-62 win at home over Rhode Island. And the thing about Dayton is that it really hasn't mattered where Anthony Grant's guys have played. They've been solid on the road, 3-1 and one straight up, 4-0 and oh against the number on the road, including a road win over SMU. A narrow loss to Northwestern and in conference play. They beat Davidson and Duquesne, both by double digits. So give uh, give credit where it's due to Dayton. And this is a Dayton team that you know is one of the best teams in the A10, you know, usually year after year. And this year so far, it's been no different. They lead the, the A10 in offensive efficiency and effective field goal percentage on offense in two point shooting. They're third in uh in three point shooting as well. Where you'd like to see this team improve is at the foul line. They're twelfth in the A10 in free throw shooting and free throw percentage. Um, and that's considering that the Dayton Flyers get to the foul line at the second highest rate in conference play. So you got to see those, uh, those numbers improve for Dayton, but with the way that they're playing defense, you might not have to, I mean, let's be real. I mean, this is a Dayton team with second in defensive efficiency in conference play first in effective field goal percentage defense, uh, three point defense or third and two point defense. There's really nothing that this Dayton team is doing badly. LaSalle on the other hand, well, LaSalle, like I said, there's there's areas where this team's game could really improve, and a lot of it's on the offensive end of the floor as well. They're 13th out of 15 teams in offensive efficiency, in dead last in effective field goal percentage, uh, dead last in two point shooting, second worst in uh, in three point shooting as well. There's like I said, there's just a lot for this team to improve on. The one thing they do well is they don't turn the ball over, but if you don't turn the ball over, that doesn't count for any points. Unfortunately, it just means that you get opportunities to get your points, and like I said, they're not really cashing in on those opportunities. On the defensive end of the floor, well, this is where it's problematic. They're 13th in defensive efficiency in conference play, 15th in offensive rebounding percentage allowed, so they're giving up a ton of second chances to opposing teams. But what else is problematic is that this is the worst three-point defense in the A-10, allowing to team, excuse me, allowing teams to shoot just under 42% from three-point range. And like I just alluded to, the Dayton Flyers are not only fifth nationally in three-point shooting, they're third in the A-10 in three-point shooting as well. I just think this one's going to be a, a bit of a tough one for LaSalle. Huge uphill climb here. I got to go with Dayton. I'm going to lay the points in this one. That's going to be my free pick. But just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, you can find those at Pick Dogs Premium. Why are your Pick Dogs? Check out our betting tools. They're 100% free. They're the best betting tool in the business and tools that you want to make sure that you have in your back pocket when you're making your best bets for the day's action. And while you're at our YouTube channel, make sure you have notifications turned on so you can be the first to be in the know when the newest content drops here at Pick Dogs. Thanks for watching. See you guys soon.